The Wolves are operating as an independent franchise this season, and one of the new players that the team went out and signed was Dominic Franco. The forward is an Army West Point graduate who has quickly made it a priority to make an impact in the community. Good job, Louie. Good job. Good yourself. Dominic Franco is in his first season with the Wolves and has been playing in the American Hockey League since 2020, something he wasn't sure would happen as early as it did. I was super fortunate. I think it was my senior year that they uh, changed the rule and allowed us to play, so uh, um, I definitely wasn't expecting it. Franco is an Army West Point graduate who became the first player to sign a professional hockey contract with the Rochester Americans upon graduating from a military service academy. You traditionally go in, you start your service, and then at uh, the two-year mark, you could try to make a decision to go play. It had been a while, and now there's, I think, four of us still playing, so it's, it's awesome just to see guys um, getting the chance. The six foot five forwards talent immediately caught the eye of head coach Bob Nardella. They have to realize what type of player they are and Dom knows and I, I saw that right away and then come this summer uh, I saw he was a free agent. Actually I saw him playing some playoff games last year too. I talked to Wendell and I said I, I love the way that kid plays. But Dominic is making a difference off the ice as well with Friends of Franco, a program that gives back to military families and service members. You can nominate someone on the website and then they pick a game and we have them come out and then after we give them tickets to the game and then after they get to meet Dom and he'll come up, sign autographs, gives them a puck. We've had active duty members, we'd have guardsmen, we've had retired uh, officers, enlisted soldiers. Pretty much everyone in the military has a different background, so it's, it's cool to hear their story. I just thank them for their support and obviously their sacrifices during their service. The name of the program really is fitting. Families who come to meet Dominic truly leave as friends of Franco. Like so much time that I'm like, <laughs> guys, like at some point we gotta go, but it was really cool and it's neat to see that this is someone that had come to games before and the impact of A, the Wolves just being a place where they, they went to and then to come back and, and share it with them. You guys come to games often or? We used to come to them all the time. Yeah. Family time's not the easiest thing uh, when it comes to service. Uh, there's deployments, there's rotation schedules, there's week training. Um, so just giving families an opportunity to get together and spend some time. Franco's time at West Point continues to make an impact in his life. You meet a lot of great people and you get a lot of great challenges and um, everyone becomes out better for it. So it's, it's, uh, it's an honor to be considered a West Point graduate. The Army is a really special place and there's a lot more to it than just the military component. So it's good to get the human side of it. A feeling that's been reciprocated at meet and greets after Wolves games this season. Franco is currently enlisted in the individual ready reserve. For now, he's enjoying his hockey career and chasing NHL dreams.